Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying, I have Wrap Snacks Icon Master P Barbecuing with my honey cheese puffs. And I have the Snyder's of Hanover pretzel pizzas. These are the Nashville hot flavor. So the Snyder's of Hanover were $2.99 at Meyer. The Wrap Snacks were $1.78 at Walmart. And- um, So the weight's greatly different. Mine's oh, 11.25 ounces. Mine's only 2.5. Yeah. Um, the the wrap snacks is something that um, uh, you really have to, to keep your eye on because uh, they bring out new flavors and they don't say new. They don't mm. say new on the package. And they look and similar. They look very similar. So like they'll, they'll change the picture of the person, but the bag is still this like gold and black and stuff right. like that. So, so you really have to just look at the character. Right, so unless it's something really new, like those Nicki Minaj truffle. Right, uh, they look completely They different. looked completely different because they had <coughs> pink on the bag, uh, but so you just have to look. So uh, barbecuing with my honey, cheese puffs. Uh, it says there's three servings in the container, about 18 puffs, one ounce, 28 grams is 150 calories, or you can eat the entire bag for 400 calories. Um, these are distributed out of Miami, Florida. So, here we go. And I'm opening it with scissors because it took me that long. It would have taken me twice <laughs> as long. If I, these are uh, the big puffs. Those are food. puffy. <laughs> um, those are puffy puffs. Taking me twice as long to um, open it with my hand. Yeah, that is thick. Mmm. I like the um, the sweet barbecue flavor. Yeah, I immediately get barbecue and it's sweet. Um, honestly, I was waiting for something, some intensity or some heat mm -mm. or some spice to hit me and it never does mm -hmm. because it's just really nice and sweet. It's sweet and smoky. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the old smokiness for the barbecue. It's not really spiced barbecue, it's just smoky barbecue. Mm -mm. Um, they're a little too big, I think. I love them. I like the I like them, and I even like the texture of them stuff. But when you're eating them, it's like they're huge. Mm -hmm. You know, they're they're very big. <laughs> I, I, yeah, they are, they, but they're good. These are bigger than you know. You have regular cheese puffs. These are bigger. Yeah, these are bigger than like a Cheeto or whatever. But the texture's terrific. The texture mm -hmm. is it's they're not hard. It's soft, but it's not mushy. It's not hard. There's no edges to it mm -hmm. that's going to hurt the roof of your mouth. Yeah. Um, that's just a really nice eating experience. It is. They're, they're good. They're really good. And uh, get ready to have 400 calories because you're going to eat the whole bag. There's for no sure. way. You're there's, sure going to eat the whole bag. Yeah, there's no way you're going to stop. I mean, you there's hardly anything in there and they're so good, you're going to be just popping them. Yeah, yeah. That, those are delicious. They're, they're very, really good. So if you see those, try them out. Yeah. yeah. I think you'll, if, if you want a sweeter, smoky flavor, that's what you get. Yeah, there's absolutely no heat whatsoever. No and I know a lot of you cannot have spice. Yeah. Those are perfect yeah, those for are you because you're still getting the barbecue flavor and the smokiness and, and the sweetness. It, it's really nice. Mm -hmm. um, so the Snyder's of Hanover pretzel pieces, these are Nashville hot. These will be really spicy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Naturally and artificially flavored sourdough hard pretzels. So this is uh, 11 servings are in the container, one ounce, 28 grams, about a third of a cup is 140 calories. And these are distributed out of Charlotte, North Carolina. It says hearty, crunchy pretzels generously seasoned with the fiery heat of chili pepper and the tangy touch of pickle flavor to capture that signature Nashville hot taste. I've never noticed pickle flavor with Nashville hot. Nashville hot, what I've noticed is it's, they're usually like with a ton of pizza chicken or something, it's, it's oily. You've had a lot of Nashville hot. Yeah, and I usually like it pretty well. It, it smells like pickle. Yeah, it tastes like pickle. Yeah, mm -hmm. it smells, smells like pickle. Most of the flavor you get, it tastes like, it doesn't taste like natural hot to me. It tastes like more of a, a spicy pickle. That's what they should have called it. Because that's what it is. They should have, but. Um, it's hot. Uh -huh. Well. Wow. <laughs> I was waiting. I put a big piece in my mouth. And the whole time I'm chewing, 
I'm only tasting pickle. Yep, pickle I pickle, get pickle, 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 pickle. But then you swallow, hello, heat. Yeah, and it's right a slow now, build. Mm -hmm, right now, it's just um, the whole back of my throat mm -hmm. where it went down is on fire. Yeah. <laughs> it, it's not a Nashville hot that I've had in other things. It's like one of my favorite things was a Nashville hot. Uh, KFC item. They don't even make them anymore. I don't think they're chicken tenders. Mm -hmm. um, that was my favorite Nashville hot. Um, they didn't taste like pickles though. This one truly is a spicy pickle flavor. So but I don't did, know if it's but did that hot. sandwich have pickle on it? It was just chicken. They were just chicken tenders. Oh, it wasn't a sandwich. I don't know, it was just oh, okay, pickles. okay. Mm -hmm. I I'm love thinking... that. And it's oily. Like I like I said, Nashville hot is usually more of an oil than mm -hmm. a sauce. It's more of an oil that they put on there, and it's super hot, but it's really it's got a really good flavor. I don't get that with this. It's it tastes all pickle. It's so funny because where it went down my throat, none of my mouth like has like like normally it's on your tongue or it's mm -hmm. on the sides of your mouth, even where you chewed it. It's not there at all. It's only that heat is only going down the back of my throat. Oh, mine's all over. Yeah, mine is just <laughs> yeah. Mine's on my tongue, roof of my mouth, uh, everywhere. No, mine is nowhere but the but going down my throat. Yeah, it's a slow build. It does go away, and it's not as intense as like uh, I think flaming hot Cheetos are more like there. Oh gosh, yeah. And intense. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And goes away. This kind of uh, the slow build, and it lingers a little longer. But uh, but it's I not like as it, hot. That like. Flaming Hot Cheeto, you're you're getting with well any of that flaming hot stuff. You're mainly getting the flaming hot, and you're not getting all the flavor. Mm -hmm. This tastes like pickle. So they have pickles. You can buy jars mm -hmm. of pickles that are spicy, spicy hot pickles. That's exactly what this tastes like. Mm -hmm. You're just getting it in the crunch of a pretzel. Yeah. So I do like it. I do like it that they have the flavor. It's too hot for me. Yeah, like, I wouldn't enjoy eating a bunch of these. No, like I wouldn't get those again. Um, I wouldn't enjoy eating those, but if they had one like a pickle flavor that wasn't that was just like in somewhere in between, not mild but not hot either, you know, just a medium heat, I would I would like that quite mm -hmm. a bit uh, because I do like the pickle and I do want a little bit of heat, but just don't not. Right. You know. And I wish they put a pickle uh, picture of a pickle or something on the front. Oh, they definitely and, should have. Because the only thing that represents. The only thing, only way you would know that that was pickle flavor is if you read the description. If you read this little description, and who reads the right description here? before my most, pasta? <laughs> most people don't. Most I, I never people, did. No, you just pick it up and go. You yeah. can see, oh, Nashville hot. I know what that tastes like, and you buy it. No, you don't know what this tastes like because no. this is not traditional. It's, it's um, not the traditional that I've had. Let's put it that way. Now, on the front, I do have to clarify. On the front, there is no picture of a pickle. On the back. Yeah. No, why didn't they put that picture on the front? On the back, there is a picture of the pickle. And I'm showing it to you now because I did not take, I take pictures and put them at the end of the video, but I didn't take a picture of that. Yeah, there's yeah, a- That there's, should have been the front. That should have been the front of their back. That was a missed opportunity because that's letting people know, hey, there's pickle in here. Um, yeah, instead of being back there, it's like, Oh, by the way, <laughs> we've included this ingredient, you know. Um, well, out of the two, I would buy these yes. any time. Yes, um, because they don't shame, <laughs> It's a shame they don't make these this product in a bigger bag. I know. It's I'm only, so and, and this bag is, way, is a lot bigger than what you actually get. So, yes. just keep that in Oh, bag. yeah, that's why I showed you the inside. Yeah. Because it's like, you will eat the whole thing. Yeah, there's not that many. There's not there, as right? many as you think in there at all. Yeah. Um, but hopefully this helps you out and now you know what to expect out of the Snyders. Uh, so I will have a picture for you at the end and thanks for watching.